So this quick video is just going to look at one of the new pieces of functionality we've just put into Smart Valve. So as you can see, I'm logged on to my jobs now. So I have two jobs here, um, one on the valve ending 054 and one on one ending 705. So as before, you can obviously flick through the jobs that you have yet to complete, which will be on your job cards here. But what we've also added now is the ability to not only have a look at the jobs you've got to complete, but the ones you've actually completed. So we've added this ops log tag now. So if I just clicked on the menu there, the third one down is now ops log. So the incomplete operations, the one you still got to do, which were the two job cards that we had on the screen there, are there. And simply clicking on those will take you through to that valve uh, to do to that job. But we've also got the recently completed ones. Um, so this looks at the jobs that you last completed on the valves and it means that you can quickly see everything that you've done um, and when you did it. So again, if you want to know the detail of that particular job, you can go in and have a look at the valve itself that you did it and then you'd obviously be able to look at the history as well from what you did. That's just a really good ready reckoner in terms of the jobs that you've completed so you can see those in your ops logs and we're going to be making some updates to this over the next few months to improve this feature to add more things probably like search in there so you can actually search for recently completed operations um, and obviously the more operations you do the longer this list will grow so a way of formatting those correctly but in the first instance just a real easy way to have a look at the jobs that you completed now in the ops log tab which you can find in the main menu there on the left hand side.